Here we are on day 13. It's been interesting. There have been some good ones, bad ones, medium ones, okay ones, definitely some good ones. And we're now on to day 13. Are we gonna go around the hump where everything's gonna come out hard, heavy, and it's just gonna kick our ass? Let's find out, shall we? Uh, there we go, there's day 13, rip that open, and... From Red Racer, we have the Temperance Pre-Prohibition Lager. All right. Going back to the days before Prohibition, this Temperance uses classic ingredients for a traditional recipe and style of beer from before the days of bootlegging. Cheers. So, this one uses water, barley, f um, flaked mace, hops, and yeast. Huh. Well, that's kind of interesting. It's good to have it go back and just sort of see what it's about. All right. Let's take us back to the pre-prohibition days. And oh my God. That looks like, yeah, very light looking. And that's, yeah, clear as clear as can be. One finger worth of head. And the smell. Mm, wow. You have a wheat smell. The mace is in there. It's got an odd smell. It's something that I wouldn't normally class as a beer smell. Wow. Wow. And this comes in at 5% ABV. All right, let's give it a shot. Cheers. Let's see what pre-prohibition tastes like. So they may have gone down the street to Lucky and picked up their beer and used it. No, I'm only kidding. I'm only kidding. It's a very light beer. Very interesting indeed. Um, it definitely is a lager. Definitely tastes pre-prohibition. Definitely has a different flavor. Um, lighter uh just something that you can down a lot of really easily that's that's interesting it's got sort of it has a very interesting light flavor that just makes you want to drink more i don't mind that that i don't mind like this lager is actually tasting quite good and quite delicious and it's got a very solid flavor on it light for its flavor but it's it's solid and it's it's quite Unique. That's what I love to see is it's unique. The score for this? 8.5 out of 10. Like a lot of people are not going to score this high because they're going to feel that they've been ripped off because it's a lager. This is a pre-prohibition lager that's got a different flavor. It actually shows you what pre-prohibition beer tastes like. Um, and what macros taste like now too with different ingredients, of course. But it's still actually really quite nice. I don't mind this at all. Um, carbonation isn't that hard. It's very easy drinking. It's, it's a nice, relaxing beer. Day 13 looks absolutely beautiful. All right, I'll be back here for day 14 and many more days. We are just about, oh God, we're over halfway and I'm running out of beer. I'm gonna have to drink more. More beer. Till next time, I am PK. You will see me for day 14 and any bonus videos in between here. And until then, cheers, stay frosty, and we'll see you tomorrow. Thanks again. Have a good night.